What's going on YouTube? Jamie the Kid Zero Zero here, back with another tournament diary for you guys. Uh, I didn't do one last week simply because it was just Dino Rabbit again, and I top eighted that event, but it was nothing special, so I really just didn't bother. Um, this week I ended up playing wind ups. I've got another locals tomorrow, but I don't know if I'll play this deck, so I figured I'd make the tournament diary now, and if I do well at that event, I'll make another one, I guess. Um, forgive any typing or stuff in the background because Cupcake is on the computer. And she can't sit still for 10 minutes while I record this. Also, just a note, Gem Knights came out to... Well, the rest of the Gem Knight stuff I need came out today, so... I'll be buying more stuff off my vendor tomorrow, so hopefully I'll have a deck profile for you guys soon. Anyway, let's get into this wind-up deck that I played. It's a little different from the profile that I did recently, so there will be some changes, but let's go through it. Start things off, of course, we played the One Hunter, the Three Rat, and the Three Shark. Just absolutely amazing cards for the deck. No surprises there. I only play two magicians. Three is t way too many. One is too few. Magician's good, but sometimes it's dead. But today it really was. It was pretty good. Uh, then I did play two rabbits. I borrowed one and I had to give it back. So I'm proxying it with this. I'll be playing one rabbit tomorrow if I end up taking this. Uh, if I don't play gem lights tomorrow, but yeah, two rabbits. Ra uh, two rabbits was great. I didn't find I needed it too much, and I never. I never felt the need for three. Two is perfect. So. Rabbit. That covers all the wind-up stuff. Uh, then of course we played the Triple Tour Guide because it's an amazing engine in this deck. Freeze and Mighties all day. Uh, the Sangan, I considered the bus, but bus just wasn't for me. Then I played the One Reaper because it's Reaper and it's a 3. It's awesome. I ended up going with double Veiler instead of three Veilers. And I cut one Veiler and put in another card uh, to give me two Maxis because... I felt like I was going to need a uh, double maxi, and I was right on the money there because I ended up playing against uh, two wind-ups, no, one wind-up, and just a few other XC spams. They were really never dead, so they were really good cards. But there were three wind-up players there, including myself, so maxi was a good card, and I was glad to I was glad to have it. I never, never disliked it except for the game against Stun where I opened two, and then the final monster was Gauze. So it's quite a high monster count, I guess, but they're all really good. Uh, the spell-wise, I played Reborn, Dark Hole, Storm, Book, all the standard stuff. Mind Control, because Mind Control's amazing. Uh, Avarice, because opening this and looping is great fun. Salvage, because I absolutely, I really like this card. I really liked it the first time I played the deck. But at the same time today, I sided it out a lot, and I never really felt the need for it as much. I never thought, oh, if only I had Salvage right now. So, I don't know how I feel about it. Uh, I played the Triple Space, because... Three spaces, just you've got to play it at the moment, and then double instant fusion because people are silly and they veil your tour guide. But yeah, that's the spells. On to the traps. I took out the chains for two compulses. I don't know if they were chains in the last video. Uh, oh, well, I think it was one chain in the last video. I ended up adding a compulse and taking a chain out for compulse. This is 42 cards now. Um, these compulses were amazing, they were never dead. A brilliant chain ability. I just really liked having them today, so. No complaints on the compulses. Double bottomless, great because I play Chaos Dragons. Double Torrential because Torrential is boss. Double warning, especially when you can go Torrential and tor Torrential and bounce your rabbit. And then I played the Judgment. That's the main deck. If I can not <coughs> like knock it all over. Uh, on to the extra deck. Of course, we played the Triple Zen Mighty. Who wouldn't? One Zen Mains. One Leviathan. One Levier. One Brilliant. One May Stroke, one Utopia, one Roach, one of the few cards I didn't make today. One Tyrus, one Odreus, I didn't make this. One Zinmaio, Zinmaio was absolutely amazing today. One Flame Ghost, one Reaper on the Nightmare for your instant fusion targets, and my Gauze Token. Finally, for the side, this was a really poorly constructed side that I literally threw together in five minutes, but we'll give it a go through. Uh, I ended up playing one extra Veiler that I took out. One Victoria, I didn't like two, so one Victoria was enough. It was great, I used it against Hieratics and Chaos Dragons, and it was just devastating every time I got it. Kaiko, absolutely amazing, dropped this against Chaos Dragons twice and Hieratics. Pfft, absolutely amazing. Uh, Penguin Soldier, uh, I really liked this card, and I, I had 14 cards on me, and I thought, ah, oh, I'll bung a Penguin Soldier in the side, and it was absolutely amazing, absolutely loved it. Um, double Snowman Eater for the Rabbit, but I didn't play against Rabbit. Uh, double Soul Taker. 
I played these against Chaos Dragons, but I never had them. I actually played Double Level Limit. I'm not sure where the other one's gone. But I played Double Level uh, level Limit. I just never drew it. So, sad face. Double Chalice. I put this in against the Wind-Up Mirror, but I never drew it. Uh, double Shadow Mirror for Insectors, but I never played against any Insector players. And then one Dust, because I might have needed more back row removal, depending on what people had sided in. But yeah, guys, that has been the deck profile. <sighs> I'm trying to remember what I played against overall now. Uh, I played round one against Hieratics and 2 0 that simply because I was able to stop his combos going off. Uh, then next I played against. I can't actually remember. Uh, game three I went up against Chaos Dragons. There. Sorry. <laughs> Yeah, game three I went up against Chaos Dragons and won that. I won all three of my first games, going 2-0 against every player. Then, next up, I played against another Chaos Dragon player and lost to him. And then I played against the TO, who was playing Chaos Stun and lost to him. And I managed to top eight on 3-2. I was not happy with my result, but hey, what are you going to do? Then in top eight, I ended up playing against uh, Glad Beasts and going 2-1 against them. I lost game one and then game two and three, I managed to bring it back. Uh, then in the top four I ended up playing against a wind up mirror match which was good fun because I had maxis and veilers coming out my ass. and then finally I played against the chaos dragon player that I beat in round three of swiss and he absolutely wrecked my face so uh, well what are you going to do either way that's the tournament diary I've got for you guys so far expect another one tomorrow I don't know what it will be but there will be some kind of tournament diary. But otherwise I will see you guys when I do this has been Jamie the Kid Zero Zero with tournament diary I think 22 or 23 <laughs> with wind-ups. Hope you've enjoyed. If there are any alterations to the deck you want to suggest, feel free to bung them in the comment section below. Um, but yeah, hope you enjoyed. Have a good one, folks. Bye.